Hello once more and welcome to a daily run! Eden. Eden's interesting, because we don't know how we're starting. Uh, we're starting with the poop. I thought I got it wrong and we're doing a blue baby run. The poop and... Ah, this could be better. Poop and... Uh, sissy Longlegs. Sissy Longlegs being the better of the two spider familiars, because it actually produces spiders sort of while you shoot, uh, as opposed to... So the one, uh, well, the one that causes spiders to appear when you get hit. Getting hit is, of course, not not in my plan. Our damage, our DPS to start with in this Eden run is outstanding. Considering, uh, I think the last Eden run we did was, mm, you know, it was debatable. Uh, we did, we got an orbital out of this, which could be valuable against Pin, but it could just be valuable to shoot him. Uh, HP is fine. I'm just going to leave. That's less than a minute for the first floor. We're only going as far as Mom's heart. That at least gives us the opportunity to do boss rush and not worry about hush, which is probably my favourite um, sort of combination of rushes. When you can't possibly do hush, uh, and well, when you can't possibly do hush, you can always do boss rush. There's no challenge run that stops earlier than the Mom fight. Uh, Hematomesis is okay. If we do the bomb to see what's in that. Tinted rock, if it turns out to be small rock, that's going to basically set us up for a long time. I hesitate to say the rest of the game, but it, it could still be very worthwhile indeed. Ah, two spirit hearts. Never come into a curse room without a bomb. This is my own undoing. Never mind. Uh, fine. Again, still no bombs. Ooh, watch out. I don't really want to use uh, the, the monster man quell any more than is really valuable. I mean, oh, no keys either. It's not such a, a potent item. Jesus, <laughs> this could be such a great floor if you only got a bomb. It's not such a potent item that it's going to hugely assist with most of the rooms that we're going to fight. It's really only going to be the boss rooms that it's going to be good on, and here is one such room. Uh, we got um, uh, Little Gish, no, the other one. Yeah, it is Little Gish. Which actually kind of helps against Larry Jr. Because Larry Jr.'s main irritation, as just discovered... Wow, careful. Uh, ...is the random quick erratic motions. And these ones are, seem to be taking up the entire fucking screen. Pardon my French. Right, we've got a damage upgrade. Uh, oh, I suppose we say Book of the Lyle. Yeah. That's uh, much better than... Dun, 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 monster manual. Oh, no bombs, no anything. We can't do anything on this floor, which is really upsetting. I have a feeling if I'd explored the extra rooms on the other floor, I could have maybe got more out of that floor. So perhaps I was over eager to leave the previous floor, floor. I will freely admit that. And I'll be happy to see what the people have achieved. Uh, Lust is not nearly as scary today as it was yesterday. If you recall yesterday's run, we had to end it at the mom fight because we just didn't get any way through. Um, which is something we're always going to be looking for. Look down, not great. We're always going to be looking for a way to get further than the game wants us to go. Uh, so there's no way around it on a daily run. In fact, there's no way around it on uh, any run that is restricted like this. But of course, the actual challenge runs, we don't want to. Oh, we don't want to go any further than we want to on the real challenge. Chair, chair, challenge runs because those challenge runs, when you've completed them, you know you, you take it, you take your achievement and to the bank, start trying to collect the things that you unlocked. I really need to get rid of that. There we go. Probably should have uh, maybe thought about using Book of Belial. It's been a while since I had it. Probably not since the last Judas run have we actually had uh, a, a full-on Book of Belial available to us. Getting bombs out of the wazoo now, uh, as expected the very floor that we really couldn't give two shits about them. Immediately after the floor where we were super hurting for them, we're getting plenty of them. I say plenty, we have two. Two, it was more than enough for the previous floor, and yet the two arrived on this floor. Such is life. HP, not even HP upgrade, just straight up HP. These things can be irritating as well, especially in an L-shaped room. We'll see what we can do. Uh, we might as well fight the boss now. We have our Book of the Loud Charge ready to go. It does give us a better opportunity to get a deal with the devil, but it's not a guaranteed one like it used to be. That's... Oh, okay. 
I actually nearly got hit by the Forsaken, which is uh, pretty shit. It is possible to be hit by the Forsaken, because the Forsaken can show up on L-shaped rooms in the chest, as I've just watched Mathis be uh, completely screwed over by this, such that you cannot do one full rotation around the Forsaken, and therefore you are guaranteed to be hit. Uh, a guppy item for free is ideal, and we've got two of these. Two I found pills as well, we found even more pills. Still no keys. I guess our quest now is for the elusive key. I've heard of such things, but I've never seen one in the wild. Like Sasquatch or the Loch Ness Monster. We are after the rarest of rare beasts. Nope. See, we've had this discussion. That's a bomb. That was what I wanted last time. No. Again. Look. <laughs> The bloody item, the secret room doesn't even get us into one of the special rooms so that we can resolve our key problem. We are just stuck keyless. Keylessness is uh, an affliction that affects a large portion of today's society. Uh, and I feel like if we can just get out of the key economy trap, the anti key bubble, that's uh, also, I can't help but notice, not a key. Guppy? Guppy? Spiders. Spiders, guppy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Amnesia, great. Well, now we can't remember <laughs> where our keys aren't. Please be a key in this room. These things are impossible to hit for quite some time after they've started. Alright, oh, I'll shoot you. Fine. Probably should have used the Book of Belial, but, you know, we're there now. At least I haven't been shot by it. You notice I waited to finish that sentence. Uh, that was entirely intentional. Now I've got plenty of bombs and I'm thinking about not using them. Try and get this thing to do my dirty work. Well, I've only got two bombs. Oh, that's a key! Ha 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 ha! Just in time as well. Uh, I will put a bomb down here. This this seems... This seems likely. Oh yeah, I was right. Pretty impressed with that. Yeah, you don't mind the same thing. Allow me to uh, blow my own crystal. That yoga's really paying off. Yeah, we'll use the other one here. Uh, you. Wow, that, that exploded extremely quickly. Wasn't a fan of that. We've got some good keys out of that, so we shouldn't be in trouble for keys for a while now. We got our bomb back, so... Can't be too salty. We've not spent a long time on this floor, considering how quickly we were going. Well, now we've got Stompy. We should have a slowdown. Well, it's not as much a slowdown as I thought, so... Okay. Just don't walk on the mushrooms. That's going to be a... A terrible fate. Uh, the shop can... I was going to say the shop can go fuck itself, but actually I'm going to go to it. Because I like that. Mm, the habit. We should probably take this. Ah, uh, this is what we want. Yes. Good damage upgrade. Uh, and we'll leave. Cool space. I'm not going to waste time on that. We need to get a press on, as usual. If we want to do boss rush. Try not to stand on the explodey rocks if you can avoid it. Okay, good. Hopefully not Curse of the Lost on this one. Oh, it's actually Catacombs 2, so we're actually going faster than we need to be. Uh, I'm going to use this here <laughs> and scare myself in the process, because these things being in charging mode is uh, bad. Like, like banks. Constantly charging you. Leave. There's actually a class action lawsuit about uh, in the UK a few years ago because of the number of banks that would charge sort of penalising fees whenever you went into your overdraft, so that you could never leave your overdraft, and uh, the, they lost. So then there was a big movement where lots of people were phoning up their banks and complaining that they've been charged uh, an unlawful fee. I'm not sure how unlawful it turned out to be, like whether you could literally say this is illegal or whether you just had a, a good leg to stand on if you complained, but nevertheless. Oh, that was dangerous. I forgot we had a uh, Stompy for a minute there. Oh, I thought it wasn't going to die and I dodged out of the way. The game of chicken you have to play with these things is fucking... Oh yeah, we can just pop these, can't we? Step on them. And then shoot that. Yeah, I don't like this game of chicken you play because if you get it wrong and you step aside and then you still kill it anyway. You end up stepping into it sort of trollishly explodey shot at the end. 
bit of a dick move, if you don't mind me saying so. Uh, I guess we could... I don't know what we can do with this. Put it here? Whatever. Like, a, a, a bomb every couple of rooms is not useless, as we've seen earlier on in this exact run, but... Oh, we should buy that key as well. I know it's a waste of money. It's not a waste of money, but... It costs us money that costs us points. Uh, this is a scary room, because we have to not step on these large quantities of mushrooms, whilst also avoiding these very fast-moving things. Probably use Book of Belial, but oh, I'll use it now. When you're halfway through a room, you're kind of reluctant to admit fault and use the item that you should have used at the start of the room when you saw how desperately awful the room was. Look, our damage is good, but it's not stupendous. Even with book, especially with Book of Belial. What is this bullshit? I'll use the Magician card, try and get some extra hits in, get it over and done with quickly. Uh, no. Not... Not correct. Not not on your best behaviour today, MV. Man, this room. At least we're not on sort of base Eve damage or some shit like that. Which has happened. You know, first floor, Eve run. First fucking room. Oh, it's super MV. Bouncing around the place and every single head takes 20 shots. And there's thousands of the fucking things. Okie dokie. We did get most of our charge back as well. Well, the entirety of our charge back, but obviously we got some of it back for the previous room. Guess we'll keep going. Oh, here's the boss. I mean, that is the goal. Find the boss. Save Jilly to save the world. I just walked full tilt into that. I thought, why not? I guess I'll just move on. Dark one. Dark One has been a problem for me in recent runs. I I admit this. I recognise this. And I promise to get better for you, friends. Yep, good job. That's me getting better. Look. Small steps, okay? I want to change, I really do. But it doesn't happen overnight. This has literally been... Do we go further? Do we find more stuff? No, I'm just going to leave. Oh... <sighs> I don't know whether Leo was a good pickup, thank you for asking. Um, I did pick it up, so we're stuck with it. Um, whether it was a correct thing to do or not. I guess it remains to be seen. It could help us with tinted drops, things like that. Maybe bridging uh, gaps to get awesome pickups. That sort of thing. But it could also do us a dirty, especially since it's slightly slower than is ideal at the moment. So a speed upgrade would go down well. No, thank you. Oh, you bounced so far, you got me anyway. Well, kudos to you, I suppose. Yeah, speed upgrade would be great. Uh, more guffy items would be great. I would like to be able to fly and produce a lot of flies and things. No. Whew. Thing. Sorted. Got me keys now. It's not a problem. I would very much like to have known what I missed out on. Uh, yeah, well done. Look, <laughs> this is a bullshit room, and it can go for I actually have a bigger problem with the leapers than with the, the fatties, because the leapers come down... Well, you, you don't know they're coming, and they shoot horizontally, so you have to move in a sort of an erratic... Oh, God, what's happening? Let's use this. Let's use this. Whew. Bit of damage. It would be nice if this was a Necronomicon, actually. I know I don't often say such a thing, but... You have to sort of execute evasive maneuvers pattern alpha or something, just to not be hit by these things when they lack, because they shoot orthogonally. Which means you can't just move horizontally or vertically. If everything's bloody jumping, there's no safe spot. Okay, we've got a bomb. Uh, we've got an easy room. We've got our item room. We'll go into it. we got a uh, bomber boy, which is A, five bombs, B, very, very dangerous. Uh, I guess we take hive mind because we no we can't because we have um oh, that's perfect it's not quite perfect but it's perfectish one more one more coin and we'll come back for hive mind because we do have production of spiders 
So Hive Mind will make those spiders that much more powerful. Managed to kite these things in a, a pleasingly suitable pattern, allowing for that reasonably efficient destruction. There's another spider. Still no coins. One more coin. I'm reluctant to backtrack all the way back to that shop, but I really do think the hive mine is a valuable pickup. So I will try to valuably pick it up. Yeah, you made the fatal mistake of trying to chase me, even though I wasn't there. So I was walking to Sinclair, I met a man who wasn't there. He wasn't there again today. I wish I wish he'd go away. So, a little nurse around for you. Yeah, I saw that coming. I was thinking, oh, it's just a, it's just a silkworm spitting. No, that wasn't a silkworm. That was a full-on brimstone laser all up in my grill. You died, okay. Oh, we can crack these skulls as well, which is likely to be valuable. We should do it after the room, though. We don't want to fight any more hosts than we have to. Help. <laughs> really? Plus... Okay, good. A hanged man. That could be good. The sun I'll just use now. Probably should have waited for a room, but whatever. Man, being slow and also being dragged along. Not my, not my favourite time in the world. Pay attention, don't look around the room. Just watch greed and make sure you're not there when he shoots you. Simple as that. Not doing a stupendous amount of damage still. Of course it would be great if we could actually hit greed, but whatever. We seem to have lost, H uh, lost coins, but we can now afford everything in the shop. So that's beneficial. Let's go and, uh, go and find the shop and not take stupid damage on the way. The Empress. 15 minutes, Necropolis 1. We really need to get out of here, but I want, I want, I really do. Hive mind, hive mind, how about you? Don't take damage on the spikes. Don't take damage on the spikes. This would be a good room to have had, um... Hive mind. The hanged man on. Say this, what is it? Can't have it. Can't have it, ha ha. Yabu sucks for you. Do you reckon it's... Oh, we know where it is. Perfect. We can't see our glorious main anymore, which is kind of the only reason I really ever take Leo in the first place. So that's the bugger. The Empress is basically a horror Babylon type thing. I think... Oh, that was a mistake. Yeah, that was a mistake. One more. I think it uh, does stack with the Book of Belial, so... Help! What's happening? Don't know what to do. So we'll save the Book of Belial, even though there seems to be enough rooms to recharge it. I don't want to run the risk that we don't have it for the boss fight. Will you fucking stand in a position where I can, can be sure that I can shoot you, sure that you can't hit me? Oh, that was very lucky. Alright, we're still just about protected for the boss fight. I really hate this room. This room can actually be harder than some of the rooms you get in the later game. Just for the simple reason that these spikes are just pains in the arse. This is... Pains in the asses? How many asses are they pains in? All of them, I guess. I mean, how many have I got? I suppose is the question. Yeah, this is probably a uh, Empress and... Uh... <laughs> oh, I don't like this shake. Green shake is scary. Probably Empress and Book of Alar room. The brownie can do some... Can you say some things, including randomly teleporting extremely quickly across the map? Which I assume is a bug, but it still happens, so... Okay, good. Let me take this one out as quickly as possible. And it's done, and deal with the devil, yes. And some black hearts to compensate for the... Oh, it's just crap, it's fine. I'll just stand here and wait. I've got time. Oh, you're doing that, are you? Uh, twice. Very well. How did you not shoot this fire, please? I was counting on you to shoot that fire. Look. The problem with this fight is you can't shoot Krampus. Krampus can shoot you. Don't think I want Krampus' head, but the damage upgrade from... Yeah. I'm going to not take it. I feel like... Oh, God, we slowed down a lot. We have to get out of here. Like now. <laughs> this is sort of. This is, um. Emperor card business right now. 
Unfortunately, we didn't find one, but... I guess we just hope for the best that we can actually get to the boss in time. Wouldn't mind a, a teleport card so that if we do find the boss, we can still do boss rush and then leave. You know, do the rest of the floor. Should have kept the sun card for this floor, maybe. I'm not sure whether I would have gone in the right direction to find the boss on the previous floor. Right, let's just leave. Try and get through this, do as many rooms as possible. This one's a pain. We found the item room, so there's that. Please, thank you. These things are just not dying fast enough. Our DPS, while well, I mentioned that obviously it would do as well for the early game, it's really not lasting us into the late game here. So, well, the, the mid game, I suppose. Again, with the not doing boss rush, this is, um. This is just. This is my fault, basically. I am not playing to my best. But. To, to my own detriment, I suppose. Oh, fuck off. Locust Horns was not worth the time it took me to find them. Oh, this is a dead end. That's it then. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we cannot get to boss in time. Certainly not with also beating said boss. Yeah, we didn't... Didn't find the necessary... Oh, that was stupid. Strength, I suppose. The, the carry. We didn't, we didn't get the carry. But it would have been a good idea to, you know, not dither quite so fucking much. But look at this. These rooms, they just take time. There's nothing you can do about it. You have to wait. You have to spend the time shooting every single fucking thing. I, I didn't... It's not like I deliberated on anything. And it's not like I... I don't really feel like I spent longer than I... Okay, I'm here now. Longer than I should have on any particular room. Or floor. I mean, I did the first floor in less than a minute. But now all of a sudden I'm uh, suffering from... Oh god, help. <laughs> suffering from the time something or several things took me. But probably they shouldn't have. Just bouncing off these, hoping for a... Oh, we got to do this again. I'm using this thing. Hoping for a, <laughs> a way out. Let's just get out of here. Probably should have used bombs more, maybe? There's, there's several things I feel like I probably could have done. Um, but at the time, I guess I didn't feel the need to. We'll do that, and then hopefully... Yes, just in time. Please don't charge me. Please don't charge me. Oh, there's another one. It's alright. Please don't charge me! Dude. I asked with a please. I said please! You have to! the rules. Where is my HP now? Hmm? Uh, we just have to survive. We can't do boss rush now. We're way too late. See how much we slowed down? This is what happens. Like, this seems to happen every time, is the point. I... I... don't... No secret room there. Interesting. I don't sort of... remember how fast you have to go. It's not in the back of my mind, or in the forefront of my mind, it's just not there. I'm not considering my own speed. Of course, there's these rooms where you just have to wait anyway. Stand at the fuck still, you absolute jackass. I mean, we could die, just because I've taken some stupid damage on this room. Yeah, we died. <sighs> I don't feel good about that. Seventh? <laughs> How did we do better on that run than we did on yesterday's run when I was convinced everyone would have just done shit? Well, I died. <laughs> uh, I didn't have as much fun today as I have done before, but I'm glad I competed. Uh, and I hope you enjoyed the episode. And if you did, please come back tomorrow when there will be more. And I will, one of these days, stop being so bad at this game. But until that day, please stick with me, and I hope it's as entertaining for you as it is frustrating for me. Good day!